Hello everybody, um, my name is uh, Lance York and this is my 1967 AMC Rebel convertible SST. Um, I'm going to do a quick walk around um, for you all real quick um, and try to get to the uh, finer points that the uh, pictures maybe not have gotten to. Uh, as you can see, paint's probably upper nines out of ten. It's incredibly nice all the way around. I just had uh, professional touch-ups done um, because I do drive it um, pretty regularly, you know, once, twice, sometimes three times a month. Um, as you can see, there's a mirror-like finish uh, throughout the whole car. Touch-ups through here. Um, and then there is another touch-up right here. If you can see that right there. Um, as far as imperfections, that is going to be it on the whole car. The chrome is in awesome shape. Also, to get a good view of that. The sun's coming back out now. These are vintage Kragers from the 60s, and they are great with very, very little pitting. Um, can barely see right there. Um, rest of the wheels are just awesome. And I may have to pause this video because it, it's 100 degrees here today in Houston, um, and the phone is getting pretty hot um, till the shade comes back out and we can resume. Underneath here, as you can see, the factory, um, I guess, rust preventative or whatever they put on it, um, still there, wheel wells and whatnot. Uh, the, the car is rust free. I took some pictures of the underneath um, so y'all can see. Um, one imperfection on the chrome is this spot right here. And the rest of it is perfect. Uh, all the trim is uh, really nice throughout the car. Uh, the stainless trim, as you can kind of see underneath here, through here. Uh, new glass, there was uh, some scratches on the glass and I decided just to get that replaced. Um, recently and it is a great decision because man it made a big difference as how the car presents itself okay i did have to pause it a little bit uh because the phone was getting awful hot the uh this is just uh the outside walk around um i'll do the the motor and um you know all the interior and stuff like that uh here a little bit later but the the color was originally blue on this car and had been uh, taken down to bare metal and uh, repainted red. Um, and it's just an awesome red at that, as you can kind of see. Um, I'll get into the, the doors here. AMC hood tack. Working. Uh, the only thing that, the only things that don't work on this car, um, windshield wipers which this car has been in rain twice since i've owned it um and i did the radio delete not radio delete but speaker delete and the dash used to have a speaker in it um that's just how they did it there's no other place as you can see here for a speaker um and so i had that redone in leather because the speaker cover you know started to, to tear up and whatnot but we'll get to the interior later but um inside of the, the doors these plates are in excellent condition as about everything else is
again, I'll do some more videos of the uh, engine and trunk and, and, and interior. I just wanted to get a good walk around of the body here. Um, so you can have a good idea of what it looks like. Because pictures, and probably this video, really don't do this car justice. It is beautiful. And very irregular. I think they made between 67 and 68, maybe 2,000 of them. Um, very few were V8s, actually. And they only offered the 290 and the 343 and the V8s. So yeah, that's the outside walk around. Um, if you want any additional pictures of, it, of anything, um, I've tried to get everything I could possibly get as far as pictures and video. Um, send me a message. I would oblige anything that you, you don't want to see uh, dive deeper into. And it is a multiple show uh, winner that I haven't lost any show I've been to, uh, real show I've been to, um, with it. It does very well. And it presents itself very well. The dual exhaust. Radial GT Road Hugger tires. All the stainless trim here, very good shape. Every, all the trim's in great shape. Well, I think that'll be enough for the outside walk around the car. I'm gonna let the phone cool off a little bit and we'll go take a drive. And uh, pretty simple, it's a three-speed uh, automatic. Um, geared really nice, uh, highway driving is awesome. Um, transmission is fully rebuilt and brand new uh, motor was rebuilt about five six years ago um, everything's been redone on the car everything <laughs>